What's going on to my Funko Freaks? This is a Funko Pop unboxing of Joker, the suit, or suit, the Suicide Squad Joker from the new movie. Uh, I had a, a Deadshot, a Deadshot masked, masked Deadshot Funko Pop unboxing. This is not a Joker one. I did say I was going to find Joker. Uh, they had two of them, and well, they had the one I found was just the regular Joker. But then here's the come at me bro joker. So I was like, let's get the come at me bro joker. It's not actually what it's called, but it's like come at me. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and do this unboxing. Uh, and as you've probably seen on my channel, uh, I love Funko Pops. I have too many of them, by the way. Starting to run out of room. So let's pull this out. So when I bought it, I already seen some flaws on it. I, after I bought it, I seen the flaws, but... Before I bought it, I was like, oh yeah, let me just get it. Let me just get the Joker one. Oh yeah. All right, there's nothing else. Just some bullshit in there. Anyways. <clears throat> throw that over there. Throw the box over there. Okay, there we go. All right. Joker, come at me, bro. Funko Pop. Is he? Is his head too big? I feel like his head too big. Maybe it's just the blanket. I don't know. Okay. Obviously, the green matches the green. Okay. Uh, okay, so this is from the new movie. Uh, the Suicide Squad movie. So we're going to zoom in. And uh, him and I threw the box. But there was something I really wanted you guys to see. Well, anyways. Oh, shit. His head turns? Okay. Oh, that is not awkward at all. Come at me, bro. Anyways. So on the box, <clears throat> Joker actually, the actual Joker in the movie, he has a tattoo that's... Oh, let that focus. He has a tattoo that's right here. It's like a, it's a smiling grin. Uh, and it's actually on the actual packaging itself. But as you see on the Funko Pop, it doesn't have it. And maybe it's because it's, you know, too small. But, I mean, damn, on the damn art you guys put on the actual thing, you know, it has it on it. But anyways, so what we have here are some crazy-ass tattoos uh, from the new Joker. A lot of people thought this was a concept art, uh, but found out it's actually the real thing. And I think he looks fucking badass. It just looks insane. Like, the Joker's insane. But if you just give him white paint and green hair, it's just like some douchebag with white paint and green hair. But now, if you put some fucking tattoos, give him a grill, and obviously say he's damaged. Uh, yeah, you got an awesome Joker, uh, which I'm excited to see, which the movie comes out August 5th. But anyways, back into these, these tattoos. So what we have here, if we can autofocus, hello. Uh, so we have ha 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 And we also have some more ha 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 These are actually tattoos. They're not like if you cut them into themselves. These are actually tattoos. Okay. And uh and as you see right here, here's supposed to be a uh, there's supposed to be like a smiley face. What's up with this dude in these smiley faces? Uh but you can see it's kinda cut off right here. But you also have the Joker. You have a kind of like a jester skull right here. And then also right here, I don't really know too much what that is. I probably have to look at the package again. Uh but also we have the damage tattoo. And if you've played the Arkham game, this like really freaks you out because like Spoil well, I, I don't even want to spoil that, but there's in the Arkham game, there's something similar with this on there. It's it's totally weird, but if it's what I think it is, that would be super fucking dope. I'm sorry, like that'd probably be. I, I don't want to spoil it because I feel like no one you haven't someone probably hasn't played the game and they're really interested in playing it. But god, this this mark, oh my god, it's so crazy. Arkham Knight play it well if you haven't played the uh, the other two wait later this year get all three of them together boom anyways uh, also one thing to notice it looks like arkham might be inside the actual movie because uh, these pants are from arkham uh and this looks like maybe you know he might have broken out of somewhere and said hey come at me bro he obviously has the the gloves on which uh if you know in any type of sporting uh place uh, you know, there's the blood gloves. I can't remember the actual name for it, but it looks like he might be torturing somebody, which in the scene, if you've seen the trailer, which I'll link it down below of my reaction to it, there's, there's a trailer where he's like, I don't want to hurt you. 
But, you know, he also has those gloves on at the same time. Well, not on this one. Maybe he wants blood, not on this hand, but on this hand. Anyways, that has been the Joker Suicide Squad Funko Pop unboxing. Come at me, bro. That's all that's that's all I that's all I see when I see this. Anyways, guys, comment and subscribe whatever makes you happy these days. My name is AB. If you want some more Funko Pop unboxing, say subscribe. Because like I'll randomly buy one and you know I, I try to buy different ones. I'm actually about to do a tracer from Overwatch because I got like this big crush on Overwatch. So anyways guys, stay tuned. Peace.